thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir. The uniform being the symbol of authority, may I ask the Honorable Prime Minister whether he is aware that some companies and security services are in fact using the same type of fabric and the same colors, and is it not high time that the outfit and the design of the police regular uniform be modified so that we have this symbol of authority? Well, I have just answered, Mr. Speaker, sir, that uh, there is a committee that has been looking into the uh, design material and other specific matters concern concerning the uniform, and precisely because previously there were other uh, private companies that were using the type of uh, uniform that there has been a change in the design and in the material and so on. Now, if the Honourable Member is alleging now that there are companies that are using the same type of uniform, the same uh, design and so on, maybe you can uh, communicate to this House, let us know, and then I will definitely ask the Commissioner of Police to look into it. Yes, I mean, if the Honourable Member is here, yes, he should communicate to us which uh, company is using the same uniform. Yes. Uh, I will certainly communicate with the Prime Minister. No, but tell the House. Tell us. But, but the, CNG, uh, the population yes. is watching you now. <laughs> yes, order, order, please. Let, let, the minister, let the Honourable Buddha ask his yes. question. The CNT and some security services CNT? are using almost the same design, Mr. Speaker. Sir. Okay. Now, May, may, I, may I ask the Honourable Prime Minister what is the budget involved and whether he is aware? I can't, I can't hear your question. May I ask the Honourable Prime Minister whether he is aware, what is the budget for this item? And the second thing is whether he is aware that the winter gear has not yet been given to the police officers so far for this year. Well, I, there are two questions in one. Huh? Yes. The budget. Mr. Speaker, sir, I've just mentioned, that's why I gave a detailed answer, so that the Honourable Member would listen, because the budget varies from year to year. There is no same amount that is being spent every year. It is according to the requirements of the police, when they do their stock taking, when they do also uh, come up with how many items they would require, then there is also, uh, of course, a, a, a discussion with the Ministry of uh, Finance so that we agree on the allocation of the amount that is going to be spent for this particular item. So, that, as I say, the budget is not the same like every year. Now, there was another question. Yes. The winter gear. There haven't yeah. been allocated winter well, gear. I, I have answered. The, all the uniforms are provided uh, according to what is prescribed. Now, the last tender, well, the last tender has been unfortunate. There has been uh, unresponsive. But that doesn't mean that we don't have uh, enough of the uniforms to provide to the officers. So the tender is going to be, I, I have been informed, that they are going to relaunch the exercise. And uh, of course, in due course, we will see what is going to be the, the outcome. Okay. Last question, Honorable Amir. Yes, sir. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Can I ask the Honorable Minister, uh, Prime Minister, sorry, uh, what is the total cost? What was, rather, the total cost of the Please procurement not. exercise of the last uniform that was procured? Not the last tender with the loss procurement exercise, and also what is the name of the company who won the contract? Well, I, let me, maybe my, my officer will give me uh, the last uh, exercise. A, okay, so for Shirts, short sleeves, the date uh, when it was procured, 24th of January 2023, 49,000 units at the, an amount of 
114,000 rupees. Now, I don't have the name of the, maybe in the meantime, while I answer the other part, uh, shirts, long sleeves, uh, again, on the 24th of uh, January 2023, was procured. 32,500 units at a cost of 11 million and 12,000 rupees. Uh, so which one is it? So the company is New Bombay Limited. I guess for, for both. 